Hey Jen, uh, after a long time I'm making YouTube video for Toyota Prius, Aqua and uh, Camry and uh, Lexus GS 450, Lexus 300 uh, 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 H uh, batteries as well for this charger I want to introduce. This charger is um, serve charging to the battery, which is like uh, uh, 190 volts to two, uh, 380 volts as well. So this is the first like uh, 280 volts is serve. Uh, it's like, it's a up and down, like it's a step up with step down. Sometime it needs, uh, your battery needs, you know, a little bit more voltage uh, for charging. So you just add on in it. So it's a 387 volts. So it means uh, you can cover to the Lexus GS450, uh, which have uh, 40 cells in it. So, and I will show you how it will operate. So, so I just, switch off the add-on voltage so it will reduce because there's nothing connected at the moment it will reduce slowly okay and uh, the other way is uh, it will go back to the 289 volt okay so very soon it will come back it's 289 volt so if I want to redu uh, turn it off, so I press, press it again. So it's go back to the zero very soon. It's react slowly because it's uh, turn off the power and is no, no, no power consuming. So it will reduce gradually. Okay, so that's the way it will operate. And uh, when you want to switch it off, you can switch it off as well. So this is the battery and that's the harness you can uh, connect with the battery. So this is negative point. Uh, we connect to the negative side and that's the positive point. We can connect with the positive point. And I give this facility in this to connect only for the Prius and uh, uh, CT200. Uh, fans as well not uh, aqua or not lexus fan i'm not a, I'm, i don't recommend to connect with this harness uh, this uh, with the lexus fan or uh, um, like a non prius like or aqua fan don't connect it is allow you only for two fans one is prius uh, third generation prius which is like um, uh, third generation Prius and uh, CT200 Lexus is allow you to serve the fan only for these two because if you see this her uh, connector is black so it means is not is not allowed to you know connect here if you can do that so you might uh, burn out your fan okay so um, is my recommendation if you just use the um, uh, Toyota Prius or uh, CT200 Lexus these two fans if you connect it so I connect this fan and the negative point with the negative and the positive point with the positive I connect it and after that I will turn on my machine and connect this yoke as soon as i connect this with the connector here and turn it on so you see the fan is start working in it and uh, fan is start serving the air is a air, air cooling start now as soon as you connect this okay and uh, when you connect to the safety clip 
here. Okay. And lock it. And then you see the battery voltage on the screen here. Okay. So if you want to uh, charge this battery so you can press it and you see is add on the amps okay is a slow charger is a it will charge your battery and it will balance your all the cells once here you see the voltage is 240 so it means it takes another four hours to balance your cells you know the balance uh, means the voltage difference in between the cells sometimes is 8.5 8.8 8.10 8.50 so it means it's not balanced so if it's the uh, balance if you want to balance so leave it at least for another four hours five hours and uh, then you will see the voltage and the amps here gradually reducing okay so amps will be reduced and you will see the battery hole is become balanced and uh, you will see the difference if you uh, check so it might be the 0.5 or point you know the 0.5 or less than 0.5 uh, volt difference in between the cells so if you found uh, the difference less than 5 volts so it means it's good when it's going to be when you put the load on this battery so th this battery will be capable to handle the um, uh, you know the um, uh, load and uh, provide the proper capacity of the battery and is uh, not reducing the volt in between these cells like not, not reducing more than one or two volt if it's reducing if it's the difference between the cells like a one volt or uh, more than 0.7 volt difference so you might get error in the car and it will show you like a hybrid battery replace or uh, some other cells at weak or whatever okay so it's better if you can balance properly and uh, before you put it back the battery into the car so give them a relax without uh, charging at least two to three hours cool down time for the battery cells uh, otherwise if the battery cells is already heated up and you put it into the car and after that uh, when you drive maybe you will lose a little bit capacity so it's better the battery cooling time is most important for battery reconditioning so this is my new invention brothers and uh, if anybody interested so this is available for sale as well so i hope is uh, it will help you know to recondition your car batteries and this is the details i add on here in the site which will can do the toyota lexus honda and these cars you know for uh, nickel metal hybrid batteries so this is the charger for nickel metal hybrid battery and uh, i hope you will enjoy this video and uh, if you have any questions, so please get back to me and leave your comments. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.